don't know, man. I don't know if I'm fucking worried, dude. That's one holiday I'm not looking forward to. I like the other holidays, but I just wish it was just one big day. I wish we'd just get it off. Oh, inauguration day should just be a crazy day, and it should happen every year, and they should do all the holidays all at once, right? They should put in the president, and then we should just party for like three days straight, right? Like somebody was talking about, you were talking about Jesus, like a Hebrew wedding. Just three days of nonstop. Trump turns water into wine, and all of, a, all of his promises come true, and, uh, and we all go out and party, right? Wouldn't that be great? I want to be at like an Easter egg haunt at a haunted house. Yeah. Somebody just to scare the hell out of you. Boo! Oh, I'm sorry, man. Merry Christmas. Here's a turkey. You can wash down with some of this green beer. I put in a Mayday basket for you. Enjoy the fireworks. If your tooth falls out, you shove it up the turkey's ass, a dollar shoots out the other end. Yes. Tooth Fairy's not a holiday. That's cool. You guys are fucked up. <laughs> we'll do it all on 420. It makes sense. Yeah. yeah. talking about surprise shits. That's fucking. That's great. I, I get surprised shit sometimes too. I eat pizza rolls. Does anybody else get drunk and do that? Well, I, like, I've realized that I think a pizza roll is the only item of food that you just can't cool down. You know what I mean? It's got like two sets. It's just like one of the, it's like a shitty shower when you get in and just like, oh, fuck, okay, okay. And then it's too cold. You know what I mean? It's either like, a, a pizza roll is either like frozen or it's burning you, you know? It's fucking with you. It has no chill mode. It has no in between. And it's the only food you can't, you just can't cut it in half. You know, that doesn't fix anything. Normally that's the thing. You're like, oh, it's so hot. And your mom's like, well, cut it in half. And you're like, okay, I'll cut it in half. And then that works. You're like, all right, the hot dog's not so hot. With a pizza roll, you cut it in half. It's like, and it just goes everywhere. And you're like, fuck. There's only 18 in there? I already lost one. And the Jimmy is at 17. I'm down to 16. I don't need to eat any of these. You're only supposed to cook like four of them at a time. Do you know that too? I never do that. I put the whole bag out there. <laughs> put the whole bag in a tray and I put it in there. And I put it for like the least amount of time possible. You know what I mean? It's like it could be, you know, 14 to 16 minutes. And you're like, all right, 10. 10 sounds cool. Tell me to do the job, right? I started like trying to taste them and shit. It didn't explode in your mouth or whatever. There's no in between. It's, it's just like, it literally feels like getting a tattoo, is what it feels like <laughs> every time you eat pizza rolls. And I always do it so drunk, I wake up, I have no skin in the top of my mouth. <laughs> I think that's what, one of the worst foods I eat, period, is just pizza rolls. It's, like, it's not even a real food, it's just like a paper and filling. <laughs> There, you know there's like a gun that that's how it gets filled up. It's not like any natural way. There's no like Keebler elves fucking cooking up your pizza rolls. It's a gun. There's a guy as an asshole go into a fucking thing every day. Maybe it's a robot, but either way I go and then that's the pizza roll. They put the slime in the thing and it comes out. They don't even have real flavor. One of the flavors is tater tot. That's a real thing. Tater tot pizza rolls. Go to Walmart after this. Check that out. All right? They just hand you an EBT card with it. They're just like, you need this. <laughs> it's fucked up, dude. Tater tot pizza rolls. Nothing says white trash like tater tot pizza. There's, there's avocado. That just sounds fucked up. That just, I don't know. That seems, yeah, right? What's, the, what's your surprise shits look like then? That's fucked up. Disgusting avocado, and then they've got combination is a flavor. That's just yeah, just combination. Kind of no, doesn't say of what or whatever. And it's not meat either, because you're like it's definitely meat. It's just different combinations. No, because they got triple meat, so it's not meat. Beyond triple meat is combination. <laughs> whatever that is, that's so fucked up, man. And you can just buy so many of them at once, too. That's the bad thing. Like, anything that you can buy in bulk that's, like, slimy is gross. <laughs> like, the gas station across the street from my house, it's got a Casey's across the street from my house. It's got, uh, yeah, it's got a fucking, well, my phone's gonna go off the whole fucking time I'm up here. I'm sorry, I'm turning this shit off. Sorry. Jesus Christ. You're sorry, too? That's cool. <laughs> Did you text me or something? Whatever. <laughs> Oh, my phone is just listening to me. This is a fucking update that says buy pizza rolls and whatever. Sponsored, Sponsored post. That's fucking cool. <laughs> the gas station, it's, it's got 
Twinkies there, and there's three Twinkies for two dollars. Which is like, yeah, how can you not? <laughs> like, that's, that's, they got it down, man. They fucking, that's one of those studies that you see, like, at the college or whatever, where they're like, would you like to sleep for seven days or whatever and get paid? And you're like, yeah, I can do that, or smoke pot or something. You know they just got a bunch of fat motherfucking dudes in a room and sat them down, and they're like, all right, fat asses, what's the number? Let's talk, let's talk money here. What's the number? How low do we need to go on the Twinkies for you to, like, I think I couldn't say no, probably at like $2 for three. I think that's where. And that's it, because my brain's like, you can't turn that down. So I usually buy the whole box. <laughs> There's 13 in the box, which is pretty fucked up too. And, uh, and I'll get the box of Twinkies. It's like $10 for the box or whatever, so I'll get the box. I'm like, you ever do this when you're in the gas station? I just start eating in line. <laughs> Is it nobody else does that? I'm the only one or whatever? I'm just like, oh, I just start eating them or whatever. And then people are looking at me like, you haven't bought that yet. And I'm like, it's fucking Casey, dude. She gets it, okay? You know the kind of stuff this bitch sees? She gets it. I'm eating the kid. Like, I'm just, I'm going to bring the wrapper up there. You can still beep. You can, I'm just pay for it or whatever, you know? Sometimes I'm eating one like at the pump. That's kind of gross or whatever. Because I'm like spilling gas all over my hand and like touching the cap, the gas cap. Oh, 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 I better eat now. Now would be the time to eat. Put it on top of the car or whatever. <laughs> so gross, man. Be eating them. I'll have half the box is gone by the time I get home, right? I do that all the time. And I say like I'm gonna have one. You know what I mean? I'll be like, I'll eat one. It's so coming a pack of two. You know. But you call two one, you don't just eat one <laughs> Twinkie. You put the, yeah, so it's two is one. So you're gonna have one, and then you're like, I'm not just gonna have one because it's fucking stupid, right? Like, you're gonna have two. You're gonna have two, right? It'd be normal to have two. And then two is three, right? You're gonna have a third. You're not just gonna not eat a third one. What are you fucking stupid? And then between three and 12, a medical blackout occurs. <laughs> where you're just, you're just eating these Twinkies, you're just shoving them down your face, sweating them, wiping the sweat with the next one. I don't even give a shit. Shut. I'm not like I'm not barely even taking time to breathe. You ever do that when it just catches up to you and you? Like, <gasps> oh shit! Then you're like, I should, I should drink something, right? And so I've like got beer from last night. I'm like, yeah, I'll drink that. I'm fucking put that down in the thing. It's so gross, man. I'll be eating these Twinkies and like we're not like girls will do this, but girls will like hide it. They'll be like, <laughs> they'll be like in their rooms doing this shit or whatever. Guys will just do this out in the open. You'll come home, there's be like 20 rappers all over the goddamn floor, right? Okay, it's like a, it's like a complete binge that I've been on, right? And then I'll stop and there's two left and I'm like, <gasps> holy shit. I just ate like 11 Twinkies. Man. And then so you're like, okay, that's fine. Those will be nice for later. Those are good for later, right? I'm not gonna eat those now. That'll be a nice little surprise. You go do like one thing, you just like move something, and then you go, and you fucking eat one of them. Did I just eat that? I don't even know. That's what I was doing. You just throw that last one away. Out of like spite, because you're like pissed off at it. You're like, I don't fucking want any of these anyways. And then you pass out. <laughs> Not from drinking from Twinkies, <laughs> food, pizza rolls. You wake up, oh, fuck, mouth all burnt or whatever. I'll have no food in my place. I'll eat that last one out of the garbage sometimes. <laughs> it's got the wrapper on it. I'm not a complete savage or whatever, but there's no food, and I'll be like, all right, it's fine. <laughs> yeah, eat two of them because there's two. Of them. Yeah. That and McDonald's, Jesus Christ, I eat at McDonald's a lot. I was at McDonald's today just staring at the menu board. Like, Holy shit. I should probably take somebody's order. <laughs> That's the last normal job I had before I started doing stand up. I got fired from McDonald's, actually. Which is interesting. It's cool. It's not like I used them. You guys were like, oh. <laughs> I didn't use the reference to get booked tonight. <laughs> hey, Ronald, will you call that octopus in Cedar Falls? See if you guys can work something out. I know you've got a cast of wacky characters. I'd like to 
to go down there and spin some vinyl for the kids. No, like, it's not how it worked out, man. So, anyways, the fucking guy fires me from McDonald's. This dude, like, loved his job as the assistant night manager or whatever of fucking McDonald's. And so the guy's like, um, Garland, can you come in my office? I was like, and I knew I was going to get fired at this vibe because I didn't show up for two weeks. <laughs> so... Usually a pretty good indicator. The guy's like, come in the office. I was like, you mean that broom closet? Okay, sure. He's like, sit on the floor, Indian style. <laughs> like a professional. I gotta tell you something. You're fired. I was like, yeah, I'm stealing your headset, bro. Yeah, now every time I work, I fucking... I even on my way down here tonight, this is why I was late, Alex. I'm sorry, I pull up in front of a McDonald's. Hello, welcome to McDonald's. You just want a new car. <laughs> I just like to screw with people, man. You can't win anything at McDonald's. They're always trying to tell you you can win something. They got that little game where you put the quarter in the water next to the thing. You're trying to catch the quarter. Nobody ever wins that game. And there's some fucking tw Somehow there's like a $20 bill in there. Someone got real crazy. Give cards and shit. Keys. People's cars. A wedding ring or two. Just get back at McDonald's. <laughs> With a wedding ring versus <laughs> a wedding ring's a, a, amount of uh, pies or whatever the fuck they're giving away. It's never anything good, right? You can't win the McDonald's Monopoly game. Okay, if you take nothing from my act, take this. You can't win, and every year they do it, right? Every year they try to do the McDonald's Monopoly game. You can't win, right? I'll prove it to you. Go out to a lake or a reservoir this summer, right? See if anybody's showing off their winnings, okay? It's never going to happen. You're never going to see a guy pull up on a jet ski like, Vroom. Hey, man, where'd you get that? Huh? The Yamaha? Vroom. McDonald's Monopoly game, duh. Vroom. As he throws out a million dollars in Pokemon cards and a fucking pogo stick. All right, I'm Tom. I got to go. Thank you so much.